You know, one of the uh, things that I really, really like about uh, using Linux is the degree of freedom that you have to customize uh, your system and set it up the way that you want to set it up and give it the look and feel that you want it to have. That's something uh, that that level of customization is just something that you don't get from a proprietary operating system put out by a company run by a guy named Steve. Steve Ballmer. Steve Jobs. But uh, anyway, so much for my dig at Apple and Microsoft. I'm not here to rain on on their, on, on those uh, on that parade. Actually, both those companies put up. You know, now that Windows 7 is out on the street, both of them put out really good products that work for. Well, let's face it, 99% of the people out there, because honestly, Linux only has about a 1% or maybe less than 1%. Uh, share of consumer desktops. The people don't know what they're missing out on. Uh, and what I'm talking about here is some people say it's chaotic and leads to uh, some confusion, but personally I like it. I think it's a good thing. You've got so many choices out there. You've got GNOME, You've got KDE, those are the two big ones. XCE is gaining a big fan base. There's uh, Evolution, or not, not Evolution, Enlightenment desktop. Any of these desktop environments that are out there you can use. And the level of customization you have in each desktop environment is just amazing. You take a look at my desktop here. Uh, you know, this is not the way I have this set up is not it's Ubuntu 9.10 but you know it, it, it didn't come out of the box looking this way and, and frankly I don't like the way Ubuntu comes out of the box uh, I'm not a big fan of the brown and orange color scheme so I changed it and that's the great thing is I'm able to change it and, and this is what you get just right out of the box you want to change something all you have to do is left click on your desktop hit change desktop background and you get the appearance preferences dialog. Now most of these, this one's out of the box, this one's out of the box, this one's out of the box. I I I, I customized a couple of these, but you have the tools to do the customization. Like this is the desktop I'm using now. Uh, I grabbed the image from Numlook, I think. I took it into the GIMP image editor and basically cloned it, put it side by side so that it looks right on my dual displays. You get themes off GNOME look. And you get a lot of different themes depending on your distribution straight out of the box. And you can further customize each of these themes uh, what controls you want to use, what colors you want to set them up, window borders, the mouse theme you're using, the icons. You can you can change all of that, and it's uh, again you can set it up the way you like it and the way you think it ought to work. You can get tools like the Avant Window Navigator, which gives you a dock. If if you like docks, personally I like docks. I keep, uh, like to keep my icons down there, uh, my my launchers and and my window switchers. Uh, in, down in a dock just keeps it out of the way just keeps it out of the way uh, I've mentioned GNOME look this is a great site if you're using the GNOME desktop environment uh, to get uh, different elements to customize your your desktop uh, there's a similar site called KDE look if you use KDE and honestly a lot of the stuff will work back and forth between uh, desktop environments. Again, you've got that choice, and that's something that you don't get with 
well something I know you don't get with Windows and I don't know I don't think you get this level of customization uh, available to you even with OS 10. I may be wrong on that got an OS 10 out user out there that knows more than I do about it and feel free to chime in but I know you don't get this level of customization with Windows uh, you know it's one of the reasons why I keep going back to it so uh, you know if you want to you want to use your computer the way somebody else thinks you should use your computer then go ahead but me I'm gonna keep using this because I like to change stuff up BRTidwell55 hope you everybody's having a great weekend